Welcome back to Tiger's Franchise, everybody. My name is Ethan. This is Hardcap Games, and we are here with opening day of 2023. So, if you missed the last episode, make sure you go check it out. Banger episode. Got a lot of free agents. Just in case you forgot, we're going to go over what our lineup is for this season here on the Tigers, and then we're going to jump right into it. So, uh, we have Akil Badu, Javi Baez, Tim Anderson, Jorge Soler, Trey Mancini, Ramon Laureano, Dansby Swanson, Mitch Garver, Fran Mil Reyes. On my bench right now, I have Josh Jung, Kevin Plowecki, Miguel Cabrera, and Willie Castro, and Riley Green. Um, I don't think it's going to cost us that much, really, to have these as our guys that are on the bench here. I think they all serve their purpose, Willie Castro especially. Miguel Cabrera is here as our first baseman representative. Josh Jung is here because I wanted to call him up. He had a great last year, and I want to see how Johan Escobar does down in the minors. Um, and if we're playing with lefties, it's Javi, Willie, uh, Anderson, Soler, Loriano, Swanson, Gar uh, Mancini, Garver, Reyes, with a Badu on the bench, um, and... Change my mind, we're doing that. Willie Castro will play left, Soler will play DH for that. So, if you guys are excited, make sure to leave a like down below. We're playing against the White Sox for opening day. You can see I sim through all of uh, the preseason, spring training. We are here, day number one. We are at the White Sox today. So, smash the like button if you guys do enjoy, and let's jump right into it. White Sox, the losers of the last World Series, probably out for a little... Uh, a little frustrated, maybe a little bit of that World Series hangover, you never know. So we are rocking with the Badu, Baez, Anderson, Soler lineup. And we do have these guys on the bench ready to come in. I might start making some subs, probably not right away, maybe later on. Um, our AAA team is like, could compete at professional level. They're all like 73 and up. Here we are, opening day. The White Sox repping their actually pretty sweet uniforms. I do like those ones. We're wearing the ones that I'm currently wearing right now. See, it's the same uniform. They got AJ Pollock. Oh, we should take a look and see what's changed with this team. Because I don't think AJ Pollock's normally on this team. So they got Luis Roberts, uh, Garcia. They have they do have Rafael Devers, Yasmani Grandal, AJ Pollock, Joan Mancada, Eloy Jimenez. I'm guessing it's Kyle Farmer, and I don't know who Sheet says. So this team's pretty solid. I'm expecting them to do pretty well this year, but I'm also expecting us to be really good. Akil Badu leading us off. Let's see if he can pick up where he left off last year. He might have just done it. He might have hit a home run in the first at bat of the nope. season. Oh my god, that was so incredibly close. 3 2 count now to Javi Baez. Uh, I've swung us two pretty poor pitches, otherwise, I would have walked by now. That might be ripped. That's such a big hit from Javi Baez. Get out of here. Nope, nope. Bro, you can't give me that animation making it seem like it's going to go out and then not let it go out. One thing I do want to say as we're getting started here is that I will be doing all the scouting for this season off screen. I've actually spent the last about maybe hour uh, going through all the prospects that it started us off with, um, writing them down in my Google Sheets that I got right here, and making sure that we will be all set. And I'm going to just, when we do like the sims in between, I'm going to... Ooh. Nice. When we do the Sims in between games, I'm going to stop every couple of days and I'm going to write down the changes that happen and which players we scouted more, who's completed, who's not, just so that you guys don't have to waste your time with it and I'll be the only one wasting time and then when I am recording, I can just cut that entire 10 minute part out. Dansby again is gonna get it. Erod almost had it, but Dansby throws him out. Nice job. I moved Dansby over to second because his arm isn't as strong as Hobby's. But if I keep them at the same position, <laughs> Fran Mil Reyes with the big play, big diving catch. Look at that. Well, he didn't quite dive. He kind of just stumbled and caught it. It's fine. Whatever. One thing that I personally have to do with this game is play it more. Because outside of, I mean, I'll play Diamond Dynasty like once a week for like two hours and be like, I'm done. And other than that, I don't play this game that much. So I think that like when we play franchise mode like this, I just have to play it more consistently. AJ Pollock is two hits away from 1,000 career hits. I don't want him to get that to me. He's not gonna get it right now. Lance Lynn delivers! Farmville Reyes is gonna rip that one foul. Gonna see a lot of that happening. I was early on that pitch though. I'm, I'm surprised. I'm normally late. 
Please stay fair. Really? Come on, why did hook? I guess it was never, it wasn't really close. Well, you know what you have to do now, Framil, is that you have to hit, hit an actual one to make up for it. Framil Reyes has drawn a walk, bringing a kill Badoo back up to the plate. Almost hit one out last time. Gonna watch one for a ball. Good eye. I didn't realize that the Tigers got a kill Badoo from the Rule 5 draft. I thought that he was like, like a Tigers guy. Was he on the Twins before? Uh, one, two count now to Eloy Jimenez, who's gonna rip one towards Akil Badu. I don't know why Badu's not playing center right now. Oh, Loriana's playing center, that's right. But Badu in left is fine with me. The Tigers open the season, leading the MLB with nine top 100 prospects. How about that, huh? Joke's on you, Dave Dombrowski. I can build a farm system. Perfect game's over. They actually got a hit. We just gotta walk. Gavin Sheets. Now, to be honest, not familiar with this guy. Second round pick in 2017, he was a White Sox pick. Okay. So he's a system guy. Ooh. Hello. Uh oh. That's not good. <laughs> Throw him out. Alright. Well, the fact that I missed that, not a good look. Um, and this is now all of a sudden a very different ball game. Considering there's only one out. Maybe this works. Ah, I'm gonna miss on home. Dang it. Alright, they're gonna come across. White Sox are gonna score. Oh, well, I should have just thrown a third then. That was a mistake. Alright, Lurie Garcia is up at the plate. And the ball's gonna go foul. Oh, that's really bad. Alright, it's 2 0 White Sox. Okay, that's a better spot. Now I can actually see the runner's box. I can see if he's gonna try and steal on me. All right, we gotta get Devers out. We can't let him just rip one out of here on us. Uh-oh. All right, we're done. We're done here. Cool. Tigers trailing 2-0 in the top of the fourth. Could really use a big at-bat from Javi Baez and I'm not gonna get it. It's gonna be a pop-out. I'm still waiting to hit a home run with Javi Baez, by the way. He has the stats for it and I just have not made that connection. I would love to hit a home run this guy, though. Tim Anderson, huge start off with. I always need to stop doing that. That's a great hit from Solaire. Fantastic hit to the wall. He's going to get down to the second, and we have a double. There we go. We are getting hits. Trey Mancini up. Solaire gets the first hit of the new season. not drop. No, it is. Go home. All right, one run scores. Good job. The slow guy is getting it done. <laughs> Love to see it. It's very nice. All right, Loriano, come on. You, you can be huge right now. You can give us the lead. No, don't like it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm, you have to pitch one right here for me. Right there. Or right here. It's a great hit. Is it going to drop? It is. Look at that. It's not a home run. Why are they showing me stat cast? Show me stat cast when I hit a home run. Dansby Swanson up at the plate now. Oppo. Nope. We're not sending. We are not sending. We're going to load the bases instead for Mr. Mitchell Garver. Who I've only hit one home run with ever. But it's okay. We're going to figure this one out. We're going to watch one. Maybe he'll walk us. Or maybe he's going to give me a ball right here for me to hit. I'm just going to place it here. 3, 2, 1, Grand Slam, Mitch Garver! Yes! Woo! Massive first home run of the year is a Grand Slam from Mitch Garver. Out of here. Tigers take a 5-2 lead in the fourth. Massive fourth inning. Uh, all this was on two outs, by the way. All this was on two outs. Framil Reyes up at the plate now. Let's go. It is slowly getting hotter and hotter in my room as I've turned off the AC and the fan. All right, good inning. All right, a uh, great, great five-run inning from Mitch Garver. They're bringing in Dallas Keuchel as their relief pitcher for Lance Lynn. Akil Badu, let's pick up where we left off. Let's hit a home run right now. Let's go. 
That ball's to dead center. It's a perfect, perfect. Tell me that ball is gone. No, nope. nope. Bro, what is with all these hits? What is with this game? Huh? How, how far did that ball go? That's cool. Thanks. That's a pop out. Classic Javi Baez moves. Nice. That's a hit to dead center against his former team, and it's not going to go anywhere. All right, Iran's at 67 pitches in the fifth inning, which is pretty solid, but... Oh, God, he'll go back. He keeps doing this a lot. Not loving it. I don't love that he does that. It's like oh, it's like most of the time... He only has two strikeouts for a reason. It's because most of these guys are taking him deep. Gavin Sheets in his first MLB game ever, I'm assuming. I don't know, he's played a bunch. He played last year, too, and the year before that. What am I talking about? Strike him out. Look, don't don't shoot me. I'm just not very familiar with the White Sox system. I don't spend a lot of time watching White Sox games. Get it over there, Tim. You got it. Nice job. All right, 2-2 count now. Jorge Soler against Dallas Keuchel. He's going to pitch it, and... Ooh, that one's going to poke on through the shift. Look at that. They're covering third pretty heavily over there. Jorge Soler getting on base. Love to see it. All right, Mancini, you're up again. Let's go. Let's hit, let's hit a nuke. Get one out of here. Get through. Nice. Get through, Mancini. You got it. You got it. Run it out. Good job. Infield single. Off of... I, some might say that's an error, but the game doesn't consider it an error. Laureano's up now. Let's go. Let's do it again. Okay. Could we have a triple play? Yes. Am I liable for it? Yeah, pretty much. Send him. Nice. That's a smart play by Mancini to go back, but Soler comes around making it a 6-2 game. Good hit, Loriano. I don't think they're going to go to Keuchel yet. Or leave Keuchel yet. I think they're going to make him finish this inning. He's only at 28 pitches. Dansby Swanson's up at the plate. A chance to... Nope. Get a double play. <laughs> I've never seen Rafi Scoops make a play this bad. <laughs> like, bro, that that's a routine play. You do that all the time. He could have had a triple play there if he played that correctly. If you immediately tagged and whipped it to second, they could have turned three of there. That's right to the shortstop. But we're going to come across, we're going to score another run, making it 7-2. That's a, that's a sacrifice ground out. I, just, I didn't think Mancini was going to run there, actually. I, I didn't... Wasn't expecting him to, honestly. That ball was going to be short. Well, another good inning. Picked up another two runs. Look at that. Doing great. I'm really trying to speed through this game as fast as I can. It is probably getting to the 80s in my room. If you see me start to sweat, I am. Last thing I need right now is Rafi Scoops at the plate. Actually, that's pretty great for me. Get him out, Erod. Oh, yours at 92. I should have had another dude warm in a while ago. Hold on. I want to go to Boxburger right now. Yeah, we're going to go to Boxburger. And I'm going to warm up Bummer as well. And now we're going to do a mound visit. That's fine. And now we can go to Boxburger. See how that works? It's kind of strange. It's a little cold, though, so I'm going to do his practice pitches. I would say, all in all, that was a pretty good outing from Erod. I think that we're just ready to move off because. He's had 92 pitches, and he's left two men on base with two outs. So we're going to go to Boxburger. Get it, Carver. You got it, Carver. You got it, Carver. Eh. <laughs> he tried. He tried his best. Strike him out. Nice. Good job, Boxburger. All right, Akil Badu, 0 for 3 on the day. He has to uh, remind you all that he is the GOAT of baseball. He's not going to do it right now, but he'll do it later. I'm going to tell Lugo he's coming in. And then once Lugo comes in, we'll warm up Edwin Diaz. We'll go to Tapera, or so we'll go to some, but maybe Bummer for the bottom of the, for the eighth, and then we'll go to the Trumpets himself for the ninth. And we're gonna walk out of here with a dub, seven two or better, preferably. Tim Anderson at the plate. Hubby Baez got a hit, by the way. That's a rip. Just foul. It's right in the middle of the zone. If I had gotten a little more under it, I think I would have been fine, but... 
Javi, you're not stealing. I'm not gonna tell you to steal. You will get thrown out, and then I'll be I'll, I'll get mad at you because you'll get thrown out. You're not going, so stop leading. <laughs> Keiko's still on the mound somehow. Nope, pop. All right, Solaire. Let's hit a let's hit a dinger. Let's hit let's hit a big fat dinger. That'd be super cool. I would love that for you. That's a well hit ball. Interesting. How close to the top of the wall was that? I could have swore that this one was gonna go out. All right, so it bounced off the bottom of the wall. Mancini, let's go. It's dinger time, my dude. You got a single and a double today. Let's go, dinger time. Woo. Nope. Jose Ruiz on the mound, and he's, I'm gonna break my bat. Unfortunate. My plan for this season is to not trade as many players. Holy slow wind up. I know la like last year we overhauled the entire team in like the first two weeks of the season and then we did it again at the trade deadline. My goal this year is to not do that. So I think that we've built a pretty solid team. We might become buyers at the trade deadline. I think in the next episode, regardless of what happens today, we're going to play Riley Green over in right field. I just want to see what happens. I think we'll lose some hitting power, but we might pick that back up in speed and fielding, with, which Fran Mil Reyes is severely lacking in. Lugo's windup is so incredibly long. I could eat a sandwich at this time. Enemy spotted. He is? Oh my god, he's gonna get gunned down. He got gunned down! Akil Badu! With the cannon, fires it in. Got him. I wonder when the show is gonna add Edwin Diaz's walkout song. Nice hit. Nice job, Loriano. Good hit. Dansby Swanson up again. One three count. One and three on the day for Dansby Swanson. One two count right now. I just swung at a horrible pitch. The sun is starting to change in here, and I can no longer see. Please get over there. We're double safe. Base hit. All right, this is Mitch Garver. I'm gonna sub Riley Green in on the for the next batter, which is from Bill Reyes. Just want to see what happens. I mean, you can't really tell anything from one at bat unless he hits a home run. In which case, I just want I just want to see. I want to just put him out there in in right field and see what happens. He's gone. Oh, he's gone. Boogity boogity booking it. Boogity booking it around the bases, Mitch Garver. Let's go. Nice double down the line. Mitch Garver having a, the game of his life today. Grand slam and an absolute rip down the line. Still no outs in this inning. Tigers have an 8-2, six run lead in the top of the eighth. This is phenomenal, this is going great. I love this. Let's pop out. Tag up and go. Oh, I didn't mean for you to go. I did not mean for Garver to go there. I just wanted. Uh, just wanted the other guy. <laughs> Alright, Akil. Let's go. Let's rip one. 9 2. Let's make it 10. Let's hit let's hit 10 runs in our first game. 10 runs in the first game is that's a, how is that a pop out? I don't get that. I don't get that. Kapow. Strike him out. Nice. Gavin Sheets is nothing. Nothing. You got nothing on us. Alright, cutter time. Pow. Never mind. I don't like that anymore. Alright, Loriano. Get it get it in. What are you doing? Throw the ball. He's fast. Uh double play. Oh, I missed. That's my fault. I missed. I didn't Hold the button long. I thought I thought I clipped the but uh, the green zone. I did not. That's not on Baez. That is on me. I will own that one. I take responsibility for my actions in this case. All right, Javi. One for four on the day. Not the best start in the world. One for five in the day. Really not the best start in the world. Tim Anderson, I need you to get one right now. I can't have you go 0 for five in the first day. And have everyone else be like three for five. 
I can't look like a fool for signing you to a massive deal. Oh my god. I, I, Tim Anderson is not good against righties. And I know that. Maybe, maybe I should, I don't really want to be moving around, like taking out players like Tim Anderson out of my lineup. Just because I'm facing a, a righty. Most pitchers in the league are righties. Alright, it's unfortunate. That's right, folks. We are here. Edwin Diaz on the mound for his first appearance as a Tiger. Trumpets are playing in the background. I'm assuming Edwin Ethan Wright. All right, let's let's get a massive, massive dub right now over the White Sox, who were in the World Series last year, get taking a 9-2 win. In what's this ballpark called? Guaranteed rate field. Well, that was the wrong guy to have batting there. One out now. One strike away from striking out AJ Pollock, making him 0 for 3 on 0 for 4 on the day. He's gonna have to wait for tomorrow to get that record. Gonna hit it to Tim Anderson. He's gonna fire. He's gonna get him for two outs. And a 3-2 count to, to Yoan Moncada. I'm going to give him a, high, a fastball high and inside. It's right down the middle instead. That was almost really bad. But instead, I'm going to do some trickery. I'm going to fire him a slider down and inside. And he's going to watch it. And he's going to get blocked. Okay. Okay. Eloy Jimenez at the plate. 1-1 one, one count. He's going to swing at one. That's 100 miles an hour. That's really nice to have. And he's going to swing at a second one. He's going to strike him out. Edwin Diaz, cue the trumpets, Tigers win, 9-2 in Chicago. The win goes to Erod, the loss goes to Lance Lynn, and the player of the game is Mitch Garver with those six RBIs off of the Grand Slam. Incredible day from him. In the next episode, we're going to be back at Comerica Park facing off against the Red Sox. By then, I will have scouted a lot more players. If you want me to, let me know and I will give you a scouting update. Uh, about who what player we're, players we're looking at, if I found anything good. But in the meantime, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you didn't, make sure you smash that like button down below and leave me a comment. Who's your favorite player on the new team? So, thanks so much for watching. My name is Ethan, and I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.